this should be a story time. Mama Zal wanted me to touch my brother-in-law's underwear because uh -uh, this is crazy. It's ridiculous. It's disgusting. just for today you can just put them how even if he is, I am not touching that underwear. How am I going to say? We are assessing the system. Matale Harry, it's a chair, we are to one. I can't say, 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 I at what point is it ever okay for Umakoti to wash her potential brother-in-law's underwear? Just to greet him. Because obviously Mama Zala, she her excuse is that you're not going to wash it yourself. The washing machine's going to wash it. Honey, the fact that I got to pick it up. What if I like pick up the wrong part? <laughs> okay, guys. Yeah, and I said, I'll end up. What if I pick up the wrong parts of the underwear? And then Mama Zala's like, no, it's clean. It's a clean. We get the lanik. We get the lanik. underwear clean. Why is it going into the washing machine if it clean? She has to hang that. Like, no. And then she's on some. He's, he's, he's still young. 19 years old. 19 years old. And you still can't wash your own underwear. And you expect to go to my coat. Uzo genzel. Ne underwear guys. Usofi guys is going through the most. I feel like Usofi um, has a lot of patience. Because we are understanding the type of person that she's dealing with. Her sister-in-law is literally a, a agapilanga guys. Like mentally, like you can just tell, you can just tell from the first episode, you could tell, oh, good, no, 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 like a right. And even the family accepts, oh, like a right. Manje having to call the nail technician. So this is what, this is what Uchabrile did. Uchabrile called a nail technician to remove Sophie's nails. Then you ask yourself, okay, if your sister's in law has in mind to call the nail technician to remove the nails, why doesn't she replace the nails that she has on now to say, okay, um, sister in law, here's money for the nails. Okay, the day you decide, because I'm, I'm making you do all these things and we're compromising your nails. So if they do get damaged in the process, Nancy Malik is to see. You're going to go to your nails. I would say you decide for the person who could say, no, 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 I'm going to remove your nails. That's crazy. That, that is 110% crazy. So, but yeah, I think by my guys, because watching the show, you realize even her family, um, sort of like encourages, so because they are shot that guys. And then you have it, Pinky, guys. Pinky is my favorite. Pinky, Pinky knows why she's there. She's not there to sweat. Pinky's just there for control. 
Just say so people can say she was there. <laughs> but um, in this episode, you see Upinke and her partner um, just trying to find out why they can't have kids. Um, not yet married, but apparently they've been trying for a while and they went to go and see a doctor at a, f- a fertility clinic. And I think this is, though not spoken about, most women are going through the irregular period situation. I know I've personally also experienced that. And what I like about how this doctor just handled the whole thing, he 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 told you what your issues are, but didn't make it seem as though there's anything wrong with you in the sense that, you know, it is your fault or anything like that. He literally gave her a solution to say, okay, even though you you are suffering from this and you have irregular periods, um, there is a way that we can fix this. Because the doctor um, told her that she is not ovulating. So pink is not ovulating. However, there is medication that can help her through that process. And I really like that approach. So that us as women, don't feel like everything is always our fault. Um, and just big up to a partner just to support that hope. Most men won't go to a clinic with you just, just for anything. So the fact that he's there and supporting her through this and, you know, not making it seem like it's her fault in a sense and just going through that with her, I think is amazing. Comment what you think about this episode. I mean, I personally, I've, I'm, I'm looking at Trafilia just grow into this woman that, we should actually admire and learn from, not change ourselves to the point where we're sacrificing our kids, we're sacrificing who we are, we're sacrificing just a lot um, just for the sake of marriage. Uh, Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel, hit that notification bell so you don't miss out on anything that I post.